<laughs> Game's over, SPF. Prepare to die, lollipop. <laughs> Ready? Munch cake chocolates, 25 cents. Yeah, I'll, I'll take some. Actually, there's a sale today. Everything's two for gun. You mean two for one? Nope. Everything's two for gun. It's a dog sled. Hey, Yuki, do you know how to drive this thing? Yeah. Okay. Mush! We'll get you, FBF! Hey, how far are we from Tokyo? Well, I think we're pretty close. I hope Miko and Yuki are okay. I'm sure they're going to be fine. Ooh. Look who's here. Hey everyone. Boy, that was fun. Miko! Yuki! You're alive! What happened to you guys? A long story, my kid sister Yuki saved my life and drove that dog sled here. You're a brave young lady, Yuki. I was so worried about you, Miko. Oh, what do you think would happen to this guy? Just another day at the office. I'd love to hear about your adventure sometime. Maybe over fondue at my place? Mmm, cheese gives me gas. You know, there's a giant spider in my bedroom, and I'm so scared. Ah, Acme Pest Control. They're terrific. Got a heavy dresser that needs moving. Oof, bad back. Yuki, hey, you ready to see the secret weapon we're about to unveil to the world? Sure. Why doesn't Miko like me? Yuki, what we are about to show you is top secret. giant robot. We are building him in order to defeat Lord Metagon and his monsters once and for all. Giant robot, I love you. What's going on? I think that's the robot's heart light. That's strange. I've never seen that happen before. Yuki, I think the robot likes you. Can you try to talk to him? Giant robot, give me a salute. Oh, would you look at that? The robot actually listens to Yuki's commands. Boy, we could sure use an agent like her. Yuki, raise your right hand. Yuki, from now on, you are not just Miko's kid sister. You are a member of Super Protection Force 51, an 11-year-old girl in charge of a giant robot. Do you swear to use him to do only good thing? Yes, sir. Welcome aboard. Yay! <laughs> Oh, hail Lord Metagon! Um, why are you half naked again? Oh, this? I was just, uh, working out when you call. Hey, boss man, doesn't bad have like a dress code policy? Note to self, talk to HR about dress code. Uh, sire, I'm afraid I have some bad news. SPF 51 agent Miko and his sidekick have escaped. But the good news is, we captured them in the hallway. But then the sidekick fooled us with the old candy for sale trick and put out her shotgun and shot us all and they escaped. But the good news is, we got a bunch of candy at a 50% discount. Would you like some? Huh. <gasps> Someone should probably clean that up. Hey, Yuki, now that you're in control of the robot, maybe we should give him a name. Hmm, 
He's really big. He's enormous. He's gigantic. Hey, why don't we call him Ginormo? Oh, that's a great name. Ginormo is a powerful weapon that should be used as a force of good in the world. And we will only use them for peaceful means. But sometimes there will be massive destruction as well. Followed by peace, of course. Yes, we yes, love peace. We Both sometimes destruction, but mostly peace. Mostly peace. Remember, Yuki, Jainoma is very powerful. He can kill half the population of Tokyo. And he's under your control. Isn't that great? Yes, sir. Where's Monster? Where's the Monster? Oh no! It's Big Baby Saurus! And he's having a temper tantrum! Yes, SPF 51, it is I, Lord Metagon. And yes, it is Big Baby Saurus, the first of my super mega monsters I am unleashing on this world. Soon, you will bow down to me, and Bad will rule the planet. <laughs> Never. What are we going to do? Yuki, I think it's time to put John Oma to good use, don't you? Let's follow in the super jet. Belly button. That's his energy star. That's where his power comes from. Hey, Nico, if we can just get a missile into that opening, we can destroy him. Great idea. Keep John Oma dancing while I maneuver the jet. <laughs> <laughs> 